Assalamu alaikum dear students you are watching MLT MCQs I am Kamran today MCQs will be from genetic and pregnancy tests and we will talk about 10 important MCQs so let's start the MCQs our MCQ number 1 is what might adversely affect the prolactin test what might adversely affect the prolactin test options for this MCQ are exercising 12 hours before the test, natural birth, multiple births or sleeping the night before the test and the right option for this MCQ is option number 1 exercising 12 hours before the test might adversely affect the prolactin test. MCQ number 2 is what will the healthcare provider do if an ill newborn is administered the PKU test? PKU stands for phenylketonuria. What will the healthcare provider do if an ill newborn is administered the PKU test? Options for this MCQ are nothing, test the newborn 3 months after birth, test the newborn 3 weeks after birth, order a genetic consult right answer for this mcq is option number three test the newborn three weeks after birth mcq number three is what will the healthcare provider do if the tasex test result is positive what will the healthcare provider do if the tasex test result is positive options for this mcq are order a CT scan, order an MRI, order genetic testing, none of the above. So the right answer for this MCQ is option number 3, order genetic testing. MCQ number 4 is what must the patient do before taking the prolactin test? What must the patient do before taking the prolactin test? Options for this MCQ are Avoid the sun Rest for 30 minutes Exercise for 30 minutes Avoid alcohol The right answer for this MCQ is Option number 2 Rest for 30 minutes. So, MCQ number 5 is the PKU test might indicate the risk of mental retardation and scissors. The PKU test might indicate the risk of mental retardation and scissors. Is this true or false? And the right answer for this MCQ is option number 1. This is true. MCQ number 6 is the lack of hexose aminidase A enzyme indicates that the patient may have multiple sclerosis, may have Tay-Sachs disease, is pregnant, is infertile and the right answer for this MCQ is option number 2, may have Tay-Sachs disease. So, the lack of hexose aminidase A enzyme indicates that the patient may have Tay-Sachs disease. Dear students, subscribe to our channel MLT MCQs. In this channel, we are giving MCQs in all subjects of MLT. These MCQs will very helpful in all types of your exams, whether the exams are from your colleges, from your universities or for foreign jobs. So kindly do subscribe our channel MLT MCQs. MCQ number 7 is what test is administered to determine if the patient may have precocious puberty? What test is administered to determine if the patient may have precocious puberty? Options are FSH test, AFP test, HCG test or inhibin A test and the right answer is FSH test. MCQ number 8 is the presence of HCG human chorionic gonadotrophin hormone in a blood sample may indicate 
प्रेगनेंसी एक्टॉपिक प्रेगनेंसी टेस्टिकुलर कैंसर और ऑल ऑफ द अबव एंड द राइट आंसर इज ऑल ऑफ द अबव द प्रेजेंस ऑफ एच सी जी इन अ ब्लड सैंपल मे इंडिकेट प्रेगनेंसी एक्टॉपिक प्रेगनेंसी एज वेल एज टेस्टिकुलर कैंसर सो एच सी जी टेस्ट इज नॉट ओनली पॉजिटिव इन प्रेगनेंसी एम सी क्यू नंबर नाइन इज वाई शुड द ब्लड सैंपल फॉर प्रोलेक्टिन बी टेकन थ्री आवर्स आफ्टर द पेशेंट अवेकन्स Why should the blood sample for prolactin be taken थ्री hours after the patient awakens? Options are: the test should always be taken immediately prior to lunch. The patient requires a good night's sleep before the test. Prolactin levels are normally high when the patient first awakens. None of the above. And the right answer for this MCQ is. Option number three: Prolactin's level are normally high when the patient first awakens. Last MCQ is: The inhibin A test is used to diagnose. The inhibin A test is used to diagnose birth defects, Tay-Sachs disease, multiple sclerosis, or none of the above. And the right answer for this MCQ is option number one. birth defects so the inhibin a test is used to diagnose birth defects thank you so much dear students for watching mlt mcqs if you found this video useful like this video and share with your friends take good care of yourself allah hafiz